this might be my first successful print. It's been kind of a nightmare the last two days. But then again, I am new to this, so I have really no idea what it, what I'm doing when it comes to the firmware. There was a lot of things to learn. This printer didn't come with any firmware. Even though the manual listed the programs that you should install, you had to go online and find them yourself. And you had to make sure that there were specific for a Delta style or Coastal Mini style printer. I'm using Marlin uh, as my firmware. Uh, the first time I downloaded Marlin I wasn't uh, didn't have very much success. Uh, I believe I might have had the Cartesian version. But at that time I didn't know there was a difference. I did a little searching online and I found a version of Marlin for the Colso Mini style printer. To get the print to stick I had to use a, a glue stick on the tape. As I said, uh, I'm unable to uh, install the heated bed as it didn't come with the, uh, the thermistor or the wiring. That'll be a future project. Um, the version of Merlin I installed on this, unfortunately, I don't think takes uh, M666 codes or M665G codes. So what I did to level the bed, um, instead of going into a pronter face here, which is what I have running now using the print of this little mall hammerhead. Um, So what I did is once I figured out all my exact measurements and uh, I believe in my assembly video I stated that the uh, smooth rods weren't all the same length. I have a set on here that are 214, a set on here that are 216 and a set on here that are 215. So in the Maryland firmware I set it to 214 so that I can get uh, do pass the paper test on the bed in the center. And then I manually adjusted each end stop to pass the paper test in each post corner. And at each adjustment in pronter face, I would home the printer. It seems to be working pretty good right now. I have yet to get it to print complicated parts. Uh, I did make an attempt to print a uh, minion, and that was completely unsuccessful. But uh, my third attempt on the mall hammerhead here is doing pretty good. It's almost complete and I see no flaws. And there's a line face on the hammerhead. I didn't want to print anything too detailed. I just want to see if I can get something decent to print on it. Just for that feeling of a small achievement after three days of struggling with trying to get the uh, display set up right. The original version of Merlin that I installed didn't have uh, the display activated in it. And when you're new to this, a little thing like that can turn into a big thing. But everything is working now. Uh, the spool, I just have a, a shelf bracket on here. One of these. Just bent up at the top, screwed on on the side. Does the job. Until I can do something prettier. And 
hour and 45 minutes later. I apologize for the horrible video. Everything's being shot from an old Galaxy S3. Almost done. Wonderful. My first successful print.